What's up, plantitos and plantitas? Kwento ko lang yung plant story namin. It started with this. Yeah. Ang laki, no? And this. Kita niyo ba ba ako? And now, this. I mean, this lang pala. What's up subscribers? Welcome back to the channel. So today, ang gagawin natin ay para sa mga plantito at plantita. So what we have here is a uh, silver satin photos. Yun yung parang variety niya. Tapos, yung unang gagawin natin is a uh, leather plant hanger na para sa ganitong plant. I mean pot. Yung kailangan natin, this one is an 80 by 3 centimeters. 10 by 2 centimeters na leather and yung rematch natin. Kunin ko lang ulit yung pot, sorry. Okay, so first one, may measure natin yung pot natin. Bale, hanapin natin yung parang middle niya. Sabihin natin this one. Tapos, imi measure natin yung circumference or diameter ba tawag doon? Kasi yung paikot niya. Uh, make sure na hindi yung dito sa taas yung may measure natin. Dito lang sa baba. Alright, so here's the measurement of the pot. Make sure, i-measure nyo yung middle ng pot ha. Kasi, yun yung magiging guide natin para hindi malaglag yung pot. So, when you already have the measurement, kukunin natin yung kalahati nito and tsaka natin i-measure yung length kung gano'ng kalaki yung butas na gagawin natin for the uh, leather plant hanger. But before that, I have to get the middle ground, middle of this one. Okay, when you're done with that, hanapin natin yung middle. Lalagyan natin ng cutting guide or cutting mark. Okay, when you're done with that, measure this one muna. Measure at least 2 centimeters from the edge. Okay, when you already have done with that one, syempre, bubutasan muna natin to para maipantay nito dito sa kabilang side. Okay, so we have our puncher here. Bale, butasan muna natin tong leather natin. Kung wala ka yung hole puncher na ganito, syempre okay lang naman yung single hole puncher natin. And this time, butasan ko lang yung dun sa other side. Okay, since we already have this one, bubutasan ko this time yung sa parang holder natin. Ito yung isasabit natin sa pako or dun sa parang curve na hook. Okay, so we're finally done nung 15cm na um, leather natin. It's a 15cm by 2 kasi yung kanina na 10cm medyo bitin. So, kumuha ulit ako ng bago para dito. So, this time, ubutasan na natin from here going this one. Okay, when you're done with this one, yung parang opening, yung slit, i-curve out natin yung edges natin. Okay, when we're done with this one, bali, attach na natin to dito sa other edge natin. Okay? So, ganito lang siya. 
And then, get your Rimache. Wait lang. Kabilang side muna pala. Yung sa 15cm muna. And, Rimache. Okay. Make sure itong maliit na ano natin, parang leather, straight siya para hindi umaalog yung plant hanger natin. And then, yung pang sara. Okay, so this time, papaluin ko na tong rematch natin. Make sure lang na pantay siya. Okay. And we're almost done with this one. Ito yung dulo natin. Bale, ito yung hawak nung pot natin. And, lagay na natin siya. Alright, so we're done with our first project. Ito yung itsura niya. Bale, let's get our pot with the silver satin photos. Tapos, gagawin natin, ipapasok natin siya dito sa middle, dito sa may butas. And, it will be like this. So, careful lang. Make sure na hindi malalaglag yung tanim natin. And, yan. Pantayin lang natin siya. Make sure pantay yung pagkalalagay natin. And, here it goes. Alright. So, here's our first project. So, now, gawain na natin yung pangalawang project natin. Alright. So, we're done with our first project yung plant hanger natin leather plant hanger and ito yun here tada anyway ang next project natin is another plant hanger pero this time parang cross type siya so what this is what we need bale dalawang 35 by 3 cm leather and dalawang 0.5 by 70 cm leather and yung parang holder natin which is this one 10 cm lang siya hopefully kasi mukhang kasi naman okay so and another one pala is yung rematch natin pang ito yung pangsara natin this time hindi natin kakailangan ng magbutas sa middle ng malaki i mean bali gagawin lang natin is magbubutas tayo ng part kung saan magkakasya tong leather na to para yun yung parang pang secure na din niya. All right? So start na tayo. Okay, so before anything else, um lagyan muna natin nung butas dito sa gitna nitong isang 35 by 3 leather natin. So hanapin natin yung middle which is this one and bali papatong mo lang yung part na to this one bali i-estimate lang din natin yung butas so find the middle one over here and siguro over here and butasan natin yung hole puncher natin again, if wala kayong hole puncher na ganito, pwede naman yung single hole puncher natin butasan natin yung gitna niya. Make sure lang na magkakasya yung leather natin na isa. This one. So, testing in natin. Okay, since pasok naman, it's all good. So, when you're done with that, kunin mo muna ulit yung coin natin, yung piso. And corner out mo lang yung mga sides. Alright, so when you're done with both, bale, kunin mo ulit yung awl mo and measure 2 centimeters from the edge. Alright, 1, 2, 
middle and the other one one two middle all right so when you're done with this one get your hole puncher pero this time yung gagamitin ko is yung uh, this one di ko lang sure kung nakikita nyo pero parang parang pahaba siya um, bali ito yung gagamitin ko para magkasya yung uh, thread, ay, I mean yung leather natin na medyo flat pwede mong gamitin yung regular puncher pero make sure na lalagyan mo nung parang um, side or parang pahaba ng kaunti para mag kasha yung flat na uh, leather mo. So, turn ko lang siya. And, butasan ko lang. Okay. So, paras na siya butas. And, may butas na yung gitna natin. So, ipapasok na natin siya. So, it will look like this. It's a letter X. Okay. So, when, you're, when we're done with this one, bale, ipapasok na natin yung flat na leather natin on each side. Okay. So, yun na gagawin natin. Alright, so we're finally done with nung cross type na leather plant hanger natin, this one. So, hindi pa siya tapos. But this time, we will be getting our flat, uh, flat na thread. I mean leather na 70cm by 0.5. So, this time, bali, bubuhol mo lang yung dulo. So, parang normal na buhol lang. And make sure na tight yung buhol na gagawin mo. Okay? And same with the other one. Okay, when we're done with this, nabuhol mo na yung isa, papasok mo lang yung yung ito yung top grain natin ha, ito yung flesh. Ipapasok lang natin siya. Parang ganito yung pagkapasok ka. Here. So, yun yung kagandahan kaya ng flat type na hole puncher. So, it will look like this. Alright? And then, pasok mo siya dun sa kabilang butas, ibubuol mo lang ulit siya. Make sure na nasa dulo and nasa tight siya para hindi malalaglag. Okay? So, it will look like this one also. Manda kabilang on the other side tataglish na tuloy ako so parang ganito siya and this time kabit na natin yung kabilang side okay so it will be looking like this para siyang pa letter x all right so para mas maayos let's get our plant this time it's the it's this plant um, this one is called uh, a medium medium so pasok lang natin siya sa gitna yeah yung length nung thread na nung leather natin pwede mo i-adjust and it shall look like this adjust natin hanggang mapantay siya okay and it should look like this alright so here's our cross type plant hanger alright so again here's our cross type plant hanger bali ingatan lang natin para hindi tumama sa plants and here's our other one parang hug parang hugger siya kasi nakapalupat sa loob alright so thank you for watching again this is Paul Bonin Vargas of Zebian Manila and 
if you're a plantito or plantita, bale, we will be raffling off this one, yung ganitong style, and isang pot na kaparehas nito. So, bale, dalawa yung mananalo. Yung isa, mananalo nitong ganitong style, and the other one will win the this style. Okay? Kasama yung pot. Pero yung tanim, hindi po kasama. Okay? So, if you want to win, bale, ipopost namin yung link nung uh, video, itong video na to, and please do share, and if also do subscribe to our channel, and we will be raffling off the winner next week. Okay? It will be, the winner will be announced on our next video. Okay? So again, thank you for watching. If may natutunan kang bago ngayon, please do comment below, and Salamat. Dios mabalos.